Thanks for joining us here on Fox 10. I'm Chief Meteorologist Jason Smith as we highlight your forecast tomorrow. A lowered severe potential, not seeing any risk in our area. It'll be a nice spring like day, but we do have to watch out as we get into the outlook for the second part of the week. Early Friday morning, we could see a low end risk of some severe weather as the next weather system approaches from the west. That's a little ways off. In the meantime, we're seeing everything beginning to improve across the area after a very, very wet situation on our Tuesday. Current temperatures 71 degrees in Mobile, 69 in Lillian, and 70 in Pace. And we had some gusty winds across the Panhandle. That should wind down as we go through the evening in the wake of this system. And uh, looking at it, perhaps a couple of pop-up thunderstorms in Mobile County, Baldwin County, as we get into the evening hours. Those should fade out with a loss of daytime heating, though, by later tonight. A couple of storms could be on the stronger side in the evening, but other than that, things are improving. We will watch out for the potential of some patchy fog in the area overnight tonight and we should be generally rain free on your Wednesday. Temperatures will feel spring like tomorrow. It'll be a little cool in the morning, but we'll be up into the low 70s in the afternoon. As we look at it, a little patchy fog around the area, then some sunshine as we go through the day tomorrow. Looking good there and a very pleasant low 70s, a spring like day ahead for tomorrow. We'll be in good shape on St. Patrick's Day on Thursday too. Another big rain of it comes in Friday. Some of those storms could be stronger than average. We'll watch that out for you here on Fox 10 News, and we should clear out again in time for the weekend. Spring-like temperatures, occasional rounds of rain, and your extended forecast.